For this problem, we're given f of xy equals the quantity x squared minus 1 times the quantity y plus 2. We're asked to find the partial derivative of f with respect to x and y. How does that work? Keep in mind, partial derivative just means we're considering only one given variable. So the partial derivative of f with respect to x is going to be, now for x, you treat y as constant and worry only about the x. So if that were a constant, what do we do? Well, remember the rule. Pull it out and worry only about the derivative of whatever term has that x. So just like that y, more like a 15 or 24 or whatever constant, we'll pull it out and take the derivative of f with respect to x of x squared minus 1. What's that? y plus 2, derivative of x squared is 2x. 1 goes to 0. Derivative of that goes to 0. So distribute this, you get 2xy plus 4x. And that's it. We're done. Now, partial derivative of f with respect to y, then same idea, but now worry about the y's. This is a constant, so pull it out. Okay, x minus 1 times the partial derivative of f with respect to y of the y plus 2 which is our x squared minus 1. Derivative of this is just 1. So that's it. We have this times 1. So that means we actually don't need the parentheses around here because we don't have to multiply by anything. We're done. That's our final answer. Thank you.